Under design path, we have ability to browse the object library. The aircraft library has multiple tabs at the top here for defined equipment. We have filtering capabilities on the columns to let us sort by specific types. Uh, the top right button in the dialog here lets us clear any filters, active filters that may be running, so that we have the possibility of going through and selecting any aircraft from the set. In this case, I'm going to start with the 777-300, so I'll click OK or select to accept that in the dialog. We'll move forward to start path, and I can start by freely placing the aircraft in the drawing, specifying if I'm tracking based on cockpit center or nose, or I can follow if I have predefined path geometry. So I'm gonna pick on my path geometry, set the aircraft to the left, and we can simply drag it through the design following the painted markings to some point where we get into maybe the apron area over here. We'll just do a, a right hand turn to pull through. So with a single uh, aircraft like this, that's moved through the design. We've done it at low speed, six miles an hour. Perhaps we'd wanna go back and adjust my speed for the first few sections to be a little faster. But nonetheless, um, we have a graphic in here. We can save it as a name, either accepting the default name, which is rather generic with a numeric increment. So 777-300ER number one, number two, number three, or we could name it something like 773 runway to taxi lane east.